We have made it to episode 23. The two fake mates are still on their little tour around the Gemma Elfina Square. However, rather than taking in the scenery, they are busy discussing their losses. I would love right now, I'll give a left bollock to still say I'm unbeaten. But some beat me and he won't give me a rematch. Who will beat you? Mitchell Manquez from mm. Venezuela. It's, it's the worst right, feeling in the world, man. man. Yeah, I've lost one fight in the last 10 years. Yeah. And I think about that every day. I could even be banging a chick and I'm thinking about losing yeah, it. Same with the u fight. It's not good, man. My u fight was on Channel 5. No, but your u so fight could have it. changed your life. How much notice did you have that? Four days. Four days. It smells like Titan's bar for a minute. Titan's flat. <laughs> I would suspect his flat smells like human piss, not horse shit. Horse shit. People trying to sell us tissues. Basically, what he's saying is he trying to sell us flip flops. He needs he needs women attention. I nearly had a straightener over this fucking t-shirt. You know, trying to like negotiate a price. The guy starts to get a bit aggressive. That's because you tried to imply that he would run off with your ten pound. He seemed a bit paranoid big, about had, things. He had a big rack of. He pros. seemed very paranoid. It, I was overreacting over a little ten pound t-shirt. Yeah, man. I don't need the drama. If we could get it on a Misfits here, yeah, you'd be down for doing that. 100%. And what's the lightest you can get down to? Let's make it realistic. Probably about 12 and a half. What the fuck is that? That's like 79 kilo, ain't it? That's the light heavyweight limit. Yeah. All right, so, I don't know where you are, though. So if you got slayed, yeah, and you was 12 and a half stone, yeah, or 12, 12 stone eight, yeah, and I still fucked you up, yeah, you won't go suicidal and you won't get all, like, Mentally no, broken. No, because I've seen your fight on the Babyton show and I've got no fucking. No fit. No, but I'm malnourished trying to make weight there. That's the, that's the, you got to bear that into consideration. Yeah, so what are you basing me on, though? Just you, like. Yeah, that's fighter. what I'm saying. So I'm, I'm kind of chubby now, isn't it? So that you ain't got no cardio. You don't live the life. I, I don't, but I don't need to live the life. As long as I weather the storm for, I'd say, a round. Oh, well, we'll find out, innit? In How many rounds do you want to do it under? How many, how many rounds do Misfits normally do it? I, I could get ready for KSI that. KSI Joe Fournier was supposed to be eight. Yeah. And just by chance, there was a street hustler nearby with a set of weighing scales. You couldn't make this shit up. How much? How much? What's this? That's a weighing scale. What kind of is this? That's an old... Whoa. How much is it to get weighed? No, because I'm going to get on, jump on, no, jump on. Get on he's going to try and charge me a hundred. No, we'll just walk away. Just jump on. How much you charge? A couple of pennies. What's up? All right, let me get on this. I've got loads of money in my wallet. 80, What yeah. does that mean? I'm going to be like 75 with this. Yo, get on. Because me and him are going to box up. Oh, my, the same way. So we meet in the middle, 75. Yeah, but I'm wearing, what you? Yeah, but I got loads of money. I'm trying wallet. to get down to 57 to beat up Isaac Lowe. No, don't start running off now, like the camera's on. That was 70, but we're clothes on. E 70, I'm 80, so in the middle. It's all hype, innit, for the cameras. Let's see what's a straight. No, it's actually genuine. I'm down no, for no, it. You, we, don't, we... you don't mean that. You don't mean that. He's trying to be controversial. Look at the hunchback, man. I can't lose a bite to a guy with a hunchback. He's trying to be controversial, man, because of this thing. No, back up, man. <laughs> He can't even, he can't even flex the pegs here. You can't even make eye contact. Are you looking at my tits for? You're looking because at my nipples, it's yeah? It's so like an A cup going on there. Yeah? Can I have second chin? Oh, you'd get fucked up, man. So, just like a streak of piss, man. Yeah, man. Streak of piss. After that little fake face-off, the piss taking from Prince Patel does not stop. Tayan's nine-year-old crusty wallet is his next target. What is this, man? Sweet what your what? life out, like, what, what is that? What do you mean? It's like, look at that wallet. Cares, you need man? to fight with me Bro, bad. Oh, you're begging. <laughs> All right, can I try a bit, yeah? He needs the Misfits fight with me. How much is this? How much is this? 20. How much is the 10, though? 20. 20, 20, 20 in total. 20, do orders. Two zero. Do orders. Your money. Price. Oh, yeah, DH, OK. okay. Yeah, that's good, man. Is that your best price, yeah? That's not my number. Yeah, that's deep. Best price, yeah? Was it nice? Yeah, that's good. What, what, what was in that one? That was good, man. Pineapple, mango, piña, nectar, semi free. All right, go on. Let me try first. It's only two pounds. Thank you. That's only two pounds. That's all it is, you know. Who the fuck does he think he is now? A food vlogger. 
It's all right, yeah, it's all right. After their little food vlog, the conversation turns to their type of women. So you know what, it's a well-known fact here yeah, that I'm into, I'm into mature women, yeah? Would you say that your type is um, junky, cricket? No, I'd say my type is uh, a clean woman. Because I keep my private life private. Bro, I'm not feeling this. I'm not feeling this place, you know. It's a bit of a shit off. I, I thought there would be better looking girls around like there. Miami sure. type, Las Vegas type. Look at this fucker. Oh, it's pissing itself because it's oh, all you. Man. Oh, shit. It's getting worse, bro. That is so yellow as well, man. Dehydrated, isn't it? Why have you got a hunchback tie man? Serious talks. Just poor genetics, poor body posture. You should get yourself a pair of trainers. No, it's just laziness, bro. Sitting on the couch, talking shit. So, the, so are the super chats working for you? Yeah, they're working. they're working. So you're like a Bill Gates, like you're just dressed down and you... Yeah, that's exactly it. Like I, I get that, I get that. Some of this shit here. Yeah. Bill Gates. Do you reckon if you were wearing better sitting, jeans, you'd do better sitting, sexually though? I'm just sitting around, man, just focused on the fucking, on the content. Bro, all this is the same. This is all the same shit. No, no, it's all the same. We're Everyone around in circles, same. man. We're not seeing anything different. We need to go to, like, clubs, bars. We need to go to clubs. It's that time don't seem to be enjoying culture. No, it's all good. What is it? Argan oil. Oh. Original Argan oil. Who is it? Man, woman? Yes, for woman. Uh, yes. Woman, yeah? It's good, original. He's saying massage. Oh, I see the massage is good. Argan oil oh, for me. Oh, Do you, you <laughs> seem like you're... Yeah, original Argan, follow me. No, nah, that one, I'm good, man. I'm all right, man. I'm all right, man. He's trying to sell you oil for massaging. We don't need no lube, man. Two pounds for a massage? Yeah, that's two pounds for a massage. Well, it sounds like... Two pounds for a massage? What, for a woman? Man or woman? Female... Man... Woman? Or man? Woman for you. Yes. Where is she? Where is she? What does she look like? Let's have a look at this woman here. What did he say? Two pounds? He said 20 dirhams. Yeah, whatever it's called, yeah. Let's see what this fucking woman looks like first. And just like that, the thought of a two-pound massage in argan oil from a Moroccan woman has made the cult leader lose his mind. You seem like you perked up there, Titan. <laughs> what, two pound see, for, a, see, yeah, for female see. contact and you've got... Well, I want to see what she looks like. Two pounds, yeah? Yo, stop fucking beeping up, man. I'm trying to take me some, down some dark alley. No, no, no. Hey, bro, it sounds like he's taking you somewhere where a guy is going to come and just yeah, grab you. you need to watch out and play with your rectum. I bet you would love to see that. Maybe that's what he wants. Tayan continues to follow this unknown man into the back streets of Marrakesh, all in the hope of receiving a two pound massage. I'm trying to take me down a dark alleyway. Now that sounds like I'm giving him a massage to people. I'm kind of interested to know what he's looking like now, isn't it? You know, because we've walked so long. What, for sexual reasons? Yeah, look at him, he keeps turning around as well. Like he's scared to lose, you know, like he's scared to lose two pounds. Like, Tyan can't fight, we've been through this no, already. Yeah. <laughs> the street hustler guides the fake mates down another dark alleyway. The two pound massage is fingertips away. Yes, well, you look better, follow me. Well, look how many men are up here. I'm not going to just give him two dollars. Yo, this looks shady as fuck. Bro, this shit looks fake shady as fuck. As they reach their destination, Tayan's voice suggests that he is beginning to feel threatened down this dark back street. You will have to tune into episode 24 and see what this mystery woman looks like offering two pound massages. If you are a member at Boxing King Media for only £2.99 pence a month, then you can watch now. Click the link. That's a wrap.